Hi there, my name's Andy. I'm one of the wine specialists based here in the Waitrose Food Hall in the basement of John Lewis, Oxford Street. Yesterday I shared with you our Beaujolais Nouveau this year, and today I'm pleased, a little late, we missed the delivery yesterday, but we have the very first of our English Nouveau. This is made for us by 16 Ridges in Worcestershire. It's made from a great variety called uh, Pinot Noir Early, Pinot Noir Precoce. I like to call it Precocious Pinot Noir. It's a mutation of Pinot Noir that ripens two to three weeks earlier than regular Pinot Noir, uh, which has given the team led by Simon Day at 16 Ridges enough time to make the wine, get it bottled, get it on the shelf for Beaujolais Nouveau, sorry, English Nouveau Day. So, English Nouveau, what's it like? This is the first English wine of 2020. They give us some sort of indication of the vintage conditions and the sort of quality that we can expect from the other English wines that have been grown this year that are being made at the moment and will be released next year. So, have a look at the colour. That is, if you watched my video on the Beaujolais Nouveau release yesterday, that is very pale, very light indeed. Um, and very typical of English Pinot Noir, of red Pinot Noir. Uh, Pinot Noir's got uh, a lot less pigmentation in the skin than some other familiar grape varieties like say Cabernet Sauvignon or Syrah. So you can expect less colour um, anyway. But this is very light because it's been very little time in contact with the skins. Um, made in the same way as Beaujolais, carbonic maceration, which means the whole grapes are fermented uh, in an enclosed space, uh, the berries burst under the, uh, uh, the pressure of fermentation and um, you get very low tannin, uh, very juicy flavours um, and quite light colours. So very pale in colour. Ooh, and it's, um, it's a proper melange of uh, tropical and uh, red fruits. I uh, think cranberry, raspberry, um, blackberry, um, there's a little bit of citrus there which I find is quite a common note in, uh, in, in young Pinot Noir. Um, yeah, that's, that's lovely. There's even the faintest touch of pineapple. Maybe I'm just imagining things. But lots and lots of fruit. Mmm. slides across the palate. It's got a lovely silky texture. It's very light in body. It's 12% alcohol. Um, lovely fruits. The sort of cranberry raspberry character is there on the finish. It's quite persistent. Nice bright acidity, not too much. Little or no tannin, as we'd expect from the method and, and the grape variety. Oh, that's absolutely lovely. I would put this up against bangers and mash. Um, it would also work really, really well with, say, a Cornish brie. Uh, nice creamy cheese. Be absolutely delicious. Uh, I'm going to go and see if I can find some now. So, um, Nouveau Day, take two. Cheers.